What's up? Xavier back again with another video. This video rant, I forgot to mention this during my last recap of this Astros game. This video rant is sponsorship by Bang Potent Brain and Body Fuel. Today's flavors, the Sour Heads and the Radical Skedaddle. They're selling these like now $1.99 or $1.49 each in my job. Never tried this before until I decided to go pick it up. But anyway, we're about to do a recap of Monday and yesterday's games between the Houston Astros and the LA Angels. The Astros were undefeated 4-0. Let's see how they did on my sister's birthday on Monday. So the Astros scored three in the top of the first inning, and I got home just in time when they scored three in the top of the first inning. Neither teams didn't score shit in the second and third inning. Angels scored two in the bottom of the fourth inning, while the Astros scored one in the top of the fourth inning. Then Angels scored one in the bottom of the fifth inning. Astros scored one in the top of the sixth inning. Neither teams didn't score shit in the seventh inning. Angels scored four in the bottom of the eighth inning. And the Astros scored one in the top of the ninth inning. But it was not enough as the final score would be Los Angeles Angels seven, Houston Astros six. Astros. Angels were four and one as the Astros fell four and one. Their first loss of the season. Now let's see how they did yesterday. Wait, hold on. All right, here we go. Angel scored two. In the bottom of the first inning, Astros scored two in the top. And Astros scored two in the top of the second inning. Neither teams didn't score shit through innings third through the third inning and the eighth inning. Hmm. Neither team didn't score shit in the third, fourth, sixth, seventh, and eighth inning. Then the Astros scored two more in the top of the ninth inning. As the final score would be Houston Astros four, Los Angeles Angels two. The Astros are now five and one as the Angels fall four and two. I didn't watch yesterday's game until it came down to the ninth inning and the Astros were leading by two. So lucky I was able to see the last minute of yesterday's game. So the Astros got tonight off and then they're back at home for their homecoming games. Tomorrow's Friday and Saturday taking on the Athletics. Monday through next Wednesday, they take on the Detroit Tigers. Next weekend, they go against the Seattle Mariners. 420 and April 21st, they go against the Colorado Rockies. Then they take on the LA Angels again, April 22nd to April 25th. Then they take on the Mariners, April 26th to April 29th. The Tampa Bay Rays, April 30th and May 4th. April 30th to May 2nd. The New York Yankees, May 4th to May 6th. George Springer and the Toronto Blue Jays, May 7th to Mother's Day, May 9th. We're going to see how that goes. Astros, even though you didn't get the job done on my sister's birthday on Monday, you made up yesterday by winning. And I'm proud of that. I was hoping y'all would go 6-0, and 
But instead, you guys are now 5-1. and one. Hey, y'all lost y'all first game of the season, so no big deal. Hopefully, y'all don't lose more games than that. But I'm glad that you guys won yesterday after y'all lost on Monday. So the Astros are now 1-1 one and one against the Angels. But I still can't believe that they swept the Athletics in their first four games. Now they got to take them on again at the crib tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday. We're going to see how that goes. But anyway, that wraps up my short thoughts about Monday and yesterday's games between the Houston Astros and the LA Angels. If you're new here, hit subscribe if you like the content and hit that notification bell for my next Astros rant. I'm so happy that baseball season is back. I am going to get back doing recaps of Lakers and Heat games. I haven't done that in a while. I decided to take a break from doing that. As for the Rockets, I'm happy that they finally ended their 20-game losing streak, but they are now back on the losing streak, and I may have to do a separate rant about the Rockets because I'm so fucking tired of hearing these guys losing. I thought they would get back on a winning streak, but the Rockets just fucking suck right now. Despite that they're my home team, they suck right now. And we don't know if our Texans quarterback, Deshaun Watson, is going to be released from his Texans contract because of the shit that he's going through right now. But I'm not going to get into that. That ain't none of my business. Get this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Leave your comment down below. I'm about to do my push-up squats and sit-ups. And when I get back, we'll be reminiscing 18 years of The Rock calling out Goldberg from the April 7th, 2003 edition of Monday Night Raw. Don't follow your dreams. Chase them. Peace. Go Houston Astros.